It's National Digital Inclusion Week. Let me emphasize that, week. You see, the last time I celebrated this occasion with you, it was for Digital Inclusion Day. And by going from a day to a week, you have expanded, and rightly so, because our digital world has expanded. And today, no matter who you are or where you live, you need access to modern communications to have a fair shot at 21st century success. That's true for urban America, rural America, and everything in between. I believe this deep in my bones, and you have my commitment here at the FCC to fight for efforts that open digital doors, expand connectivity, and extend the reach of broadband. So let me talk about one area out of so many where I think this is especially critical. That involves students. You see, today, seven in 10 teachers assign homework that requires broadband access. But FCC data show that one in three households do not subscribe to broadband. And where those numbers overlap is what I call the homework gap. According to the Senate Joint Economic Committee, the homework gap is real. It affects 12 million school children all across the country. So imagine what it feels like for those students. Just getting nightly schoolwork done is hard. Applying for a scholarship is challenging. And while some families without broadband at home have smartphones, let me submit to you that a small screen with a limited data plan is not the way you want to research and type a paper, apply for jobs, or further your education. We can do better. 12 million is a big number, but it's not impossible to fix it. I think we need to make that a goal and get it done. So consider this an invitation. Please give me your ideas, all of them, the good, the crazy, and the ones where you just have a slight inkling they could work. Tell me what solutions you are seeing, from programs to lower the cost of broadband service, to efforts to increase access to Wi-Fi, to work to put routers on school buses and turn ride time into connected time for homework. Some communities are even doing something really low tech to solve the problem of access to high tech, developing homework gap maps for students that help them identify where in town they can reliably get the internet signal they need to safely do their homework. So again, this is not just a message, it's an invitation. Because you understand what it means when communities are consigned to the wrong side of the digital divide. And I think the homework gap is the cruelest part of the digital divide, but it's one that with your help, we are going to bridge and fix.